Hello everyone. In this video we're going to talk about a technology called Powerline Networking. Now sometimes there might be cases in your home or office where you wanted a certain computer in a certain part of the building to be able to access the internet. But for whatever reason network cabling or Wi-Fi just wasn't an option in that part of the building. Maybe because of difficulties in the structure of the building or interference or whatever. So to help solve this kind of problem, a newer technology gave the ability to network using the existing electrical system of the building. Powerline networking gives the ability of Ethernet networking over power. So for example, let's say you needed this computer up here to be able to access the internet. But for some reason you can't get any network cables or any Wi-Fi signal to reach that computer. So in this case, we're going to use Powerline networking. So we're going to need a couple of Powerline adapters like these here. And these Powerline adapters plug directly into a power outlet and they have a built-in Ethernet port for an RJ45 connector. So one adapter plugs into the power outlet next to the modem or router down here. And then you would plug an Ethernet cable from the modem or router into the power line adapter. Then you would plug the other power line adapter into the power outlet next to this computer up here and then you would connect an Ethernet cable from the network port of the computer into the power line adapters Ethernet port. So now Ethernet network data will use the building's existing electrical wiring to deliver networking data to the other power line adapter so that the computer can access the internet. Now power line networking works similar to DSL technology because in DSL the same phone line is able to carry both data and voice but they are on different frequencies which is very similar to how power line networking works where the same lines are used to carry electricity and network data at different frequencies. So this is an extremely convenient option to have, especially when running new cables is too much of a hassle or if there's too much interference to use Wi-Fi. You can just simply use the building's existing electrical wiring to network data. And that's pretty much it. There is no software configuration or real hardware configuration. You just plug in the adapters and plug in the network cables and you're ready to go. And if you're interested in getting some of these power line adapters, I have a link in the description below of the network adapters that I recommend.